Albuquerque thieves breaking into cars. It's a story we hear all too often these days as that kind of crime has spiked in the city. But as News 13 So Young Kim tells us, burglars took something in a recent break in that couldn't have possibly been valuable, at least to them. So Alex, what was stolen was more than 1,000 handwritten cards and letters that were supposed to be a big part of the holiday care packages a local organization is planning to send to troops deployed overseas. Our window was completely shattered. That's what Carol Sanchez saw when she returned to her car after eating dinner at Hibachi One in Albuquerque with friends last night. This friend is a teacher and she was bringing me her classes, um, cards and letters that they had written. Carol is a member of the Rio Grande Valley Blue Star Mothers. The group prepares and sends care packages for the troops four times a year. In the mix of candy and beef jerky, the letters are what the troops cherish most. They do not get a lot of mail, so they keep them, they keep them close to them, and they read them over and over again. Carol remembers what some of those letters said. Thank you for what you do. Uh, Merry Christmas, come home safe. When her car was broken into, the box with more than a thousand cards and letters was the only thing that was stolen from her car. They were handmade, somebody took the time to think about our troops, um, what they're going through. They look close enough, they would have seen, you know, the coloring of, of children. The restaurant did have surveillance cameras, but the car was parked in the back row, and as you can see, that video doesn't show too much. The Blue Star mothers say what's inside the box probably isn't worth much to whoever stole it. But a price tag can't be put on what they're worth to soldiers deployed overseas. I hope you realize that um, you took from the troops. Both Carol and Marlene have children serving in the military and they say they're devastated about what happened, but are also thankful because they've already received commitments from the community to write more letters. Back to you. All right, so young, thanks. The Rio Grande Valley chapter of the Blue Star Moms has been around since 2004.